Hello my friends, and welcome back to our continued by Let's Play Torrent's Passage for the PC. My name is Flatless Bar, this is Starbase Gaming Channel, and today we're trying to find a route. Yes, trying to find a route. Uh, it's really that simple. And apparently it does grow on trees. So what we need to do, well we check this tree. I, there's two trees we haven't really done anything with, and that's the spike tree. But there's also this tree over here that we we need to look for. So so let's go and uh, go around, just check out some trees, and uh, we'll we'll try to figure out a way to uh, continue forward. Hope we're all having a wonderful, fantastic, awesome day today. Okay, so that makes us go out. Ooh, these spines are razor sharp. I'd better be careful. And seems like can't really use anything on the tree, right? I mean, all we really have is a crystal and an axe. So if we're gonna chop off a root. You think that you think that that would work all right hey we got something is this the root it's a root it's a square root okay <laughs> I mean yeah, the math person to me is uh, chuckling at this weird thing, but it is a root. So we got a root. Huzzah! We got a root. So what that means is we may be able to now get the root to this guy, and then we'll be able to make that uh, drink that he needs. And uh, we've done appetizer, main course, and dessert. So this should be everything, right? Here you go. One large root. Want to help me fix it? No, I'll just wait right here. What a lazy. Somehow, I guessed as much. Yeah. Hey, nice square shape, too. Them's the best kind. Okay, how about if I make it into a pie? I hope you know how to do that, because I don't have anything left. Apparently, Toyn is a really good baker. I don't know why or how, but, you know, he's really good at it. While that's in the oven baking, why don't you and I head back to the Phenocrest chamber? Sure, what is that? Ah, just smell that aroma. You know, there's nothing like coming home to find the square root pie. Huh. Ooh, say, uh, we going uh. out on that joke? <laughs> no, we're going out through the secret passage. I'm the one who made the math joke. And then you make it in, you know? I thought mine Wait was here funnier. I get <laughs> Pick a shard. Any shard. <laughs> uh, the one on the left. I've been waiting 15 years to use that line. Because left is always right. Can I actually do that? Yeah, one on the left. Left is always right. There you go, boy. The joint's all yours. I'm going to grab my pie and hit the road. Got to get on home, you know. <laughs> that is, if I can remember where home is. But wait, what about me? Aren't you supposed to train me in how this thing works? Yeah. Works? Can't. Don't remember. <laughs> Heck, it don't matter no way, boy. Nobody's come through here in years. Oh, boy. But is this the way to the lands below? Could be. But you don't care. All you gotta do is make sure nobody from down there gets up here. I don't think it did your job because that uh, Licentia, was that the name? Licentia, she kind of came up here and wrecked things. Uh, okay, there's a couple things we can look at. We can look at this thing, we can look at this thing. Let me start with this one. It must be important to this huge crystal or it wouldn't be protected by those giant stones. Something over here. Okay. All I have to do is lower all of those stones. 
But how do I... Okay... Only have one. Oh! Oh! Okay. I go here. Looks like I gotta wait for it to load. Banzai! Oh, is it so bad? That was really good. Now, how do I get through this thing? Well, let's look at the thing that popped up. This powder must be important, but what if there isn't any of it in the lands below? I'd better find something to hold enough so I can get home again. Do I have anything like that? This powder. Maybe I had to use Boggle here. Because he has some stuff, right? Nah, Boogle would never hold still that long. Hmm. Now, how do I get through this thing? I need a container, which I don't have. Maybe with him gone, I can pilfer something of his. I mean, this is my place now, right? Looks like the old boy took the square root pie and split. Hope he doesn't get a divide by zero. <laughs> <laughs> I actually have a uh, a friend who's sort of an eccentric math genius. Uh, he said that he knows now how to divide by zero. So, you know, in a couple months, there may be a breakthrough in the math world. I don't know. Maybe not. Looks like the old. I don't see anything. I don't see any containers I can. Looks like the old boy. Why did that show up as. I guess it's because it was close to the chair? This thing seems to have a really big radius. But I don't have anything that I could use as a container. This looks none the worse for wear. I need to find a case of emergency. I need to find a container somehow. That's not what I want to do. Try it again. So what I want to do is I want to go back to the other places we've already explored. Because there's a chance that something may have opened up. Oh, this game does seem to be the type of game that does that. Like, uh, Book of Unwritten Tales did that. You had to go back and forth to previous places that you've already examined. This game doesn't Hello? seem like that. This game seems like the type of game you. that, um... I'm asleep. How could you be? You're talking. No, I'm not. I'm asleep. You are not. This game seems to be the type of game not that's two. not like that. Are not. Two. I give up. Besides, if a sorceress is anywhere, she's not in Crystal City. But hey, it's worth a shot. Sorry for stepping on you so much, Boogie. I mean, I need a container, a bowl. Maybe I miss something at my house. Cause, but I'm looking for a bowl or a container. Can I get in here? Like that would be a great place to put something cause I haven't been there yet. Let's check our home again. 
Containers up here. Can't do anything with those. What is this? Pouch. Hey, Dad's old tobacco pouch would be perfect for carrying the Oresti powder. There we go. That's what I needed. Man, I, w I never saw this. It's like so small. And that, and I think it's because of the chair there. But since I knew I was looking for some sort of container, that sort of helped. Okay, so we have a container for a powder. There should be... There should be nothing else that we need. Then again... Uh, dude, can you go this way? Torn? Thank you. Okay, let's see if I can use this to capture the powder. I can. Good, 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 good. I'd better get enough of this powder to last. If it does take me to the lands below, I'll need enough to get home again. That was really clever. And thank you, Sarah, for making me not go into this new area without this. Because Sarah has a tendency to do that sometimes. There'll be like many, many chapters later. Haha, ha, you failed the game because you forgot to get something. How do I get? So now we have to use this on this. Hit it, Boog. Hang on, Boogle. I hope I'm right about this. Whoa! That was cool. I hope we're still alive after that. Chapter two, Escarpa. So I assume this is the lanes below. Sir, they were both in there. And they're gone. And the child. Missing. The child must be found immediately. Oh, thankfully we landed on something soft. Would have really sucked if we just died as soon as we left. Whoa! I just had to say something. Good catch, though, Torn. And not so soft, but. <laughs> Man, he really, he really dodged a bunch of bullets there, Torn. The one lucky kid. Well, except for the fact that your parents got turned into jello by an evil witch, you know. Yeah, besides that, the heck did we just pick up a tile? The heck is this thing anyway? Uh looks like a looks like an old floppy disk. Yes, I, I did I do know what those are. Well not a floppy disk, a um eh, maybe a floppy disk. Maybe what were those uh, things called? They, they weren't floppy disks, but they were zip disks, I think they were called. Kind of looks more like a zip disk. Um, I don't see anything up here. There is another tile here, though. Oh, not again. We don't have our axe anymore. Deja vu, anyone? <laughs> All right, well, we got both tiles now. What, for every reason why? I wonder if you had to use these in there. No, you don't, okay. Wanted to try the obvious thing first. Let's head to the door because the door is left. Live on City Rom from beautiful cliffside Escarpa, it's the Bitter Nuts. Okay, what do we enter a TV Just show? Like Mr. And starring Sandra Bullhockey as Mrs. <laughs> Sandra Bullhockey. <laughs> McCulking. <laughs> Ha, ha, ha. 
<laughs> oh, I see another tile on the table. Today, we join the Bitter Nuts just as they hear a knock on their door. Just a minute. Holly, can you get that? Oh, never mind. Do I have to do everything around here? Coming! <laughs> How did they know no. we were coming? Aren't you the giant economy size visitor? And why are we the only thing colored? <laughs> You know, I'd ask you in, but I'm not sure there's enough air in here. Okay. Holly, take a look at this guy. This is what a real man looks like. Yeah, that's right. Flex. <laughs> Holly? Oh, honey, don't mind him. He's just acting his IQ. <laughs> I love the point so, laugh track. Uh, you want to come in? Or maybe that should be... Can you come in? I can duck. <laughs> Why, thank you. I will. Hey, Mom, I... <laughs> <laughs> hey, Mom, I... Whoa! Who's the big guy? <laughs> We don't know, honey. <laughs> We're still waiting to find out. This is weird. <laughs> this is so weird. Uh, hello. My name is Torin from the lands above. I'm Mrs. Bitternut, and this is what's left of my husband, Mr. Bitternut. <laughs> and that's Bobby, our son. Hi, Bobby. <laughs> wow. That, that was weird. So, uh, what's that thing in your purse? <laughs> Why, that's my little buddy, Oogle. <laughs> Why oh, is everything he black and white, basically? Yeah? Then he won't fit in here. <laughs> if he's smart, he'll stay off my furniture. Wow. Be <laughs> nice to Boogle. Boogle's a good... Boogle. Whatever he is. Uh, hi, Bobby. Hello, young man. Did he touch you, boy? <gasps> not really, Mom. What do you mean, not really? You touch that boy again, I'll have you arrested. Yikes. We don't need no uppity strangers from some other land touching our kids. I, mean, I don't blame them, but I'm just saying hi and offering a handshake. <laughs> yeah, let's not talk to Bobby. Talk to her? Uh, she's seen now? Mrs. Bitternut, I was wondering... Selfish. That's all they are. Lived right across the chasm for years. Do we ever hear from them? I'm sorry, what? Oh, that King Rupert. He really fries my cornbread. King Rupert. <laughs> I wonder if that's the king we saw from the Lives beginning. Lives almost next door. Does he ever invite us over? No. <laughs> Why? You think he was better than us or something? <laughs> okay, let's talk to Kid again. Hello, young man. Did he touch? <gasps> no. What do you? Okay, I just wanted to see if there was anything I'm sure different. King Rupert means to. We got a nice point for that you. for something. Perhaps he's just busy. Mmm, busy for twenty years, and that queen of his die. Yeah. She should. Wow. <laughs> Why? What's wrong with her? Too snooty for me. That's what, Toring. Why, <laughs> she acts like they didn't have a daughter that was... Hey, have you met their daughter? No. What about their daughter? Her name's Lena, or something like that. That's a nice name. <laughs> Why are you laughing at that? That's a nice name. You two should get together, Toring. You have so much in common. What, we're all colorized? We do? Like what? 
Oh, uh, your looks, I suppose. <laughs> I think that's exactly what it is. <laughs> yeah, you two deserve each other. <laughs> Talk to her one more How time. How would you describe Lena? Want well, to see what, uh, a loop see. to happen. Uh, she has a nice personality. <laughs> she Heck is this? Kind to her parents, I suppose. <laughs> She's a good climber. <laughs> She's lots of fun. <laughs> Take it she doesn't like her. She's a good dancer. <laughs> She's got a great personality. I think it, yeah, she doesn't like her In very much words, at all. She's a lot like you. These people are weird. Oh, um, I think I now know what these mean. Oh, I know what these mean now. Because I saw a, um, when the game was loading, there was a screen that popped up. that said when you click on Boogle, you can see all of, yeah, Boogle's actions. These are the shapes Boogle can become. Because look, you know, there's a face, uh, there's a face, that's when he became a bag to trap the, uh, the little guys. So these are all the different shapes of Boogle. So we have a yo-yo. We have a warm, we have a lantern, shovel, and a bag. How would you describe? Well, uh, I want to go through all that again. Okay, let's see if there's anything else before we talk to the husband. Like I said, it's a big tile. Hey, what are you doing? Put that down. What? That's weird. Almost every single game I've ever played, you know, you just walk into someone's house and you take their stuff and they don't have a problem. But in this game, no. In this game, they have to have a problem with it. Um, how do I... I, I need to get that tile somehow. I mean, it's a point-and-click adventure game. You need to get everything that's not nailed down. That's usually how you win a game. How do you do, sir? My name is Torin. Leave him alone. He ain't spoke to nobody in years. <laughs> yes, I can see why. <laughs> Be nice, Torn. How do you do, sir? Leave. Yeah. Okay, so. How do you? Yeah. How I do thought you I was. Yeah. Thought I was clicking on something over his head. Okay, so this tile here, but I don't know how to get the tile because we got to get rid of her before we can get the tile. Oh, he's got a yo-yo. Can I... I? I think he learned how to be yo-yo because he watched him be yo-yo. That might have been it. Okay, we're gonna have to come back here because obviously we had to do some of these people, but I have no idea what. Be sure to join us next time when we hear Bobby better not ask. I don't know how that stain got there, Mom. What is with this place? This is the weirdest the thing. Better Nuts is not filmed before a live audience. This is the strangest thing ever. These people are living a TV show. And you just randomly walk in and the game know or the, the TV show knows that you're walked in. It's so bizarre. Did I want to go up that way? Did Wiggle just learn something? No, I don't think so. Wait, wait, wait. What just happened? <laughs> I think Wiggle just got a wash. Hey, Google, let's go. Okay. I want to check out this area first. If I can. Okay, down left, up. Down right. Down right takes you down there. So I don't think you can go across this way. No, you cannot. Alright. Let's 
So who's the green guy? At least he's got color to him. Hello. She's so busy washing, she never even noticed me. Hello. She's okay. Once again, just just do my old tried and true method of try everything. Hmm. Hello. She okay, not really sure what to do there. Okay, that takes me. Okay, so that takes me up here. Cool. It's kind of where I wanted to go to originally. Well, well, what have we here? What is that? It's nice to see humility in some. What is up with this? Here. Good day, sir. Yes, it is, isn't it? But then every day is a good day here in Paris. And what are they wearing? A land as lovely as this should be called paradise. Maybe it should, but we call it a scop. But the real question is, what do we call you? Very confused. Oh, forgive me, sir. My name is Torin of the lands above. I am Rupert, king of Scarpa. And this is my lovely wife, Queen Di. Oh, how do you do, ma'am? Alarmed, I'm sure. <laughs> eh? What's that? I said, charmed, I'm sure. Uh, that's nice. Okay. I hope this isn't one of those buffets with a eat all you take policy. Okay, I got a uh, hunk of meat. Crystals. I love the artwork over your throne, Your Majesty. Why, thank you. But somehow I've always felt my shard collection was incomplete. I have a shard. Incomplete is your memory, you specious fool. What's that you say, darling? I said, no art can compete with our <laughs> memories, my precious jewel. <laughs> oh, yes, quite so, quite so. What do you think, boy? Isn't she something? Yes. Yes, that's that she is. <laughs> So can I use this here? Your Majesty, I can see you are a lover of crystals. Yes, that's the only kind he is. What did you say? I said, yes, and how kind he <laughs> is. <laughs> I, thank you, dear. But continue, boy. <sighs> I humbly offer you this gift from the lands above. I think it will balance your set of crystal shards. May I? Yes, of course. Thing grew, that thing grew quite a lot. There. <clears throat> and as this one simple shard completes the connection between the formerly distinct spectra above us, so too, therefore, may our two worlds be connected by uh, the, uh, the, the peace and uh, understanding that uh, comes from, um, you know, it, like that, there. <laughs> uh. Here, here. I have no oh, idea what that did. I say, what the devil was the boy talking about, Di? Beats me. Di, what did you say? I said, beats me. <laughs> well, so, I'll consider it. Whoa! I thank whoa, 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 whoa! It's perfect. And in return, I'd like to present you with this invitation to next week's Royal Ball. Nice swap. Shard for free tickets, you cheapskate. What? What did you say, Di? I said, I hope he's still free at this late date. <laughs> oh. <laughs> yes, boy, do attend. Thank you, Your Majesty. Okay, so we got... We got a Royal Ball invitation now. I wonder if we get that to the family to get him out of the house so we can get the other tile. Uh, we also notice we have Voyage Biv over here. Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, violet. The, the rainbow colors. Your crystal array looks beautiful, King Rupert. Yes, thanks to you, Torrin. Okay. Mm, I better not. I bet 
that the king has heard enough jokes like, I suppose she's your biggest fan. <laughs> Is it back then forth or forth then back? Oh, the mysteries of the universe we may never know. What are we standing on? Your Majesty, this tile seems similar to others I've seen around Escarpa. Oh, yes, I suppose it is. It was the most popular style a few years ago. May I have it for my collection? But what for? Oh, nothing, I guess. I just kind of liked it. No, not without a very good reason. Uh, I need a reason. Can we... Okay, I guess we gotta know what we need it for first. What is all this thing playing piano? This is really weird. Why is that I there? King Rupert, Queen Di, I am here seeking Licentia, an evil sorceress who may be in this area. Have you heard of her? Well, I haven't heard of any Licentia. He hasn't heard of anything he can remember. What's that, my queen? I said, if you'd heard a thing, you'd have her dismembered. <laughs> yes, that's true. She's not here in Escarpa, young man. Perhaps she's in some other world below us. But you are welcome to stay here as my guest for as long as you wish. They seem nice, at least. Thank you, your majesty. Do you know how to get to the worlds below Escarpa? It seems I recall a connection back when I was a young boy, Mary. Oh, but lately we've seen no one at all from the other world. I don't know why. I, I, I suppose we've just lost touch. You can say that again. Eh? I missed that die. I said, I say, that's a sin. <laughs> well, yes, I suppose. <clears throat> I didn't realize you felt so strongly about foreign affairs. If you only knew. I cannot stay long in Escarpa. I must find Licentia. Yes, I understand. But in your travels, if you happen upon a young lady named Lena, would you give her a message? That's of his course. daughter. But right? how will I know her? What does she look like? Um, well. Lena is, um, very tall. Um, yes, nearly as tall as you. And nearly as unsightly. Excuse me? I said she should call home nightly. <laughs> oh. I like this character trait when she says something that's honest and then she tries to correct it to make it sound nicer. Is Lena from Escarpa? Of course. She is my daughter. Oh, really? A princess? Has she been gone long? Only a few days, but parents worry nonetheless. I understand. I know what it's like to miss a loved one. Die, my dear. Why don't you give this boy a piece of your jewelry? That way Lena will know he represents us. Oh, brother, are you right in his pocket? What was that? I said, tell her mother sent her this locket. <laughs> oh, yes. Good idea. So after talking to this person multiple times, I was able to get an item. So we definitely want to talk to everyone as much as possible. Take this one. See? It has a picture of Rupert and me on the inside. I promise to keep it safe until I find her. Um... It's just a locket. Can't do anything else here, strangely enough. Okay, let's exit out of this. I do want to continue you talking. You mentioned a message for Lena, your majesty. Why, yes. Tell her to come home. We all miss her greatly. At least one of us. Eh? What's that you say, Di? I said, every last one of us. Oh. Well, 
Yes, that's right. So tell her that, my boy, if you happen upon her, that is. I will. I can't wait to meet Lena. I've never met a princess before. She is a wonderful child, so sweet-natured I miss her greatly. <laughs> I can believe that. What was that? I said, uh, I can believe that <laughs> you miss her. <laughs> Godspeed, Torrin, <sighs> and may our paths cross again soon. Oh, that was great. I can't wait. She what? I okay, so that's what? the same. I can't wait. She what? And talking to her is the same as talking to him. And we've already done that. Your crystal Yeah. Looks beautiful. We can't do anything about this until we figure out what the tiles are for. And I think I was supposed to get the invitation to the uh to the um to the uh the family. Only here. Okay, so let's go back to the family's house. We now return you to the bitter nuts. <laughs> Just a minute. Coming. I love the constant. Uh, do I have to do everything around here? TV show like thing here. Okay, so first off, food. Secondly, invitation. Mrs. B, I just came from King Rupert, and he asked me to give you this. What is it? Because remember, she was complaining about never An being able to go over. To the royal ball. <laughs> <laughs> Fake incense. <laughs> We're going to the ball. Ain't you excited? Oh, he's never been excited in his life. <laughs> <laughs> Toring, if there's anything we own that you need for your journey, why, just help yourself. It's yours. Excellent. Now we get the third tile. Why, thank you, Mrs. B. Of course. I'd love it if you'd take the mister over there. <laughs> <laughs> So we can get the tile. Hey, hey, what are you doing? Put that down. That's my best trivet. You just said there's anything oh, I Mom, need. Mom, let him have it. You haven't cooked since I was born. <laughs> <laughs> the kid's right. Go on, take it. <laughs> Huzzah. All right, we got three tiles now. But we still can't get that fourth tile until we know what to do with it. But don't go taking anything else, you hear? And good luck on your quest, young man. Hey, any chance of you taking Junior along with you? None whatsoever, I'm afraid. <laughs> but uh, thanks for the trivet, Mrs. B. Sorry if you heard me sniffling in the background there. Nose is... Mm, Hit it, Boog. <clears throat> yeah, it's been a, uh, it's been like three days of nonstop rain and Be messing sure with me. Be sure to join us next time when we hear Bobby bitter not ask. I don't know how that stain. All right, you said that already. Okay, let's go down here. So we have three of these tiles. We have the locket. Can't seem to do anything with this person. Hello. She's so. Hi, Birdie. Hi, Birdie. How you doing, Birdie? All right. Well, what the heck is that? Hello. Hello? <laughs> I thought he was gonna jump at first. I'm like, this is a bad idea. Oh, 
Alright, so I don't... There's something over there. But... No idea what to do with it. Wait, 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 wait. Do we have to get... Oh, I, I need to check the socks. Hold on, I, I need to go back. Sorry, y'all. I, I need to know... If that's something I can interact with or not. Someone left Aha. this clothespin just hanging here. Alright, so nothing with the socks, but we got the clothespin. So, good, good, good. Going back up really paid off. Now where? This looks like something could slide down. Why don't we go in the cave first? There's another... This looks like... The mouth of a beast. I've got it. Am I about to get eaten? Hey, you! What a stench! I wonder what's inside there. Wow, I didn't get eaten. I'm shocked. Probably get eaten if you go a little bit further, though, right? No. Can't go any, can't go anywhere else here. All right, well that's the creepiest cave I think I've ever been in. That ramp juts out even farther than the vulture's nest below it. All right, um, probably. We can use meat here. Wonder if we should go see the vulture first. So I think you slide down the meat to make the Hello? vulture go away. My name is Torin. It's hey, two out of vulture. Out of oh, tripe, you're such a grump. Hello, young man. Uh, hey. Hello. May I walk past? But of course. No! This is our ledge. Why don't you just jump off? Tripe? Oh, just ignore him. He's just a grumpy old <laughs> stick of the <laughs> Don't talk to him, Viscera. He must be up to no good. I don't like him. Besides that, he's ugly. Alright, uh, hello, how you doing? Well, yeah, you're ugly. You're skinny and, and tall. Why, I've only seen one person tall as you. Tripe, stop it. Come to think of it, young man, you do remind me of someone hereabouts. Someone special, too. Royalty. The princess? She'd be quite a catch for someone that looks like, uh, someone of your, uh, appearance. She? Oh, really? Uh, but, uh, I'm not in the habit of taking dating advice from a vulture. On the other hand, I would like to get past you so I could head up those steps. Would you mind if I asked you to move from your nest? Of course not. Thank you. But you're not going to do it anyway. I ain't good. Yeah, I figured it much. Now, Tripe, we could go for a little flight. I know my wing could sure use a stretch. This one is a nice birdie. Nope. My wing is fine. Not moving. Happy right here. I hereby order you to fly away. <laughs> I don't think that's going to work. I order you to shut <laughs> up. And, chance, did I forget to mention... Go away! There's just no reasoning with him when he's in one of his moods. Yeah, and I'm always in one. Boo! Yeah, right. I got a point for that. No, he has only one thing on his mind. His stomach. Maybe some dead meat will come flying by here. You never know. Yep, that's why we gotta use the meat. Thanks for nothing. Boo! Yeah. You know that. So I guess that was a tip on how to get past the birds. But I mean, we kind of already trial and errored that. Hey, vulture, try and catch this. <laughs> hey, viscera. Look at that! Fresh dead meat! Flying! 
Hey, let's go after it. As always, I'm with you. Not as always. Oh, well, Viscera, yeah, okay. It's the other one that's not with the other one. Can't you hurry up a little? It's getting away from us. For goodness sake, for once in your life, can't you just stop and smell the <laughs> What's that beside that little tree? Why, oh, do you see something down there, Torrin? How strange. Wouldn't it be funny if we, like, could go out on it and just die and, you know, then we come back. I haven't seen a lot of death scenes besides earlier in the game. Uh, let's see. Can't use that, but we can go this way. Can I? Hmm. If only I could make that tree grow. Hmm. So we're kind of trying to go down, I guess. Magic powder doesn't work like that. Okay. Maybe we need the uh, the thing from the uh, the green guy that was up there. Okay, we'll be here now. Can you make that? Oh, I think we can make it, Boog. Oh, nice jump. Wow, Prince of Persia here. Down or up? Hang on, Boog. I hope this is worth it. Should have gone up. <sighs> I should have gone up. <laughs> oh, we're already here. Might as well look around. Another tile. Fan. Is that essence of weakness? <laughs> <laughs> Just pick up anything that's not nailed down. And we have so much stuff all of a sudden. Oh, it's gonna be a pain. Again. Uh, that's the weirdest sign I've ever seen. Wait, I picked it up? That's the weirdest thing I've ever seen. How do I... This oh, sorry about that. Whoa! <laughs> that didn't look too good. You've discovered the fast way to get to the lands below. Oops. Oh, that's what the sign means. Oh. Sign means that it's broke. Oh. I want to hear what the dialogue was, though. This ladder looks a little rickety, but I'm going to try it anyway. Yeah, Boogle's like, that's a bad idea. <laughs> Looks like there's another tile over there. So we gotta do something with this ladder. There's no use to do that now. I'll save it for a Phoenix. Huh. It's always weird that we could use it. I'm not really sure what to do there. <laughs> He's really athletic. I gotta hand it to him. So let's try going up this time. Is that you? No, wait. I think it's coming from up ahead. Uh oh, Boog. Skunks ahead. Uh oh. Hey, skunks, are you there? I'm here. Are you Max? Hey, it's Sam and Max! And why do you win? Hey! Oh, well, I was uh, just wondering. Go check Could out our Sam and Max hit the road playthrough on the channel if you haven't seen it already. Try. <laughs> yeah, come on. It's been a while since our last target practice. 
Fellas, let me pass. I'm a stranger in a strange land. Exactly. You got that right. What do you think, Sam? Oh, I don't know. Why don't we put it up for a vote, Max? Good idea, Sam. Okay. All those in favor of letting just any Yahoo go wandering through our domicile, disrupting our comfortable lifestyle, and tracking in that horrible human odor, say aye. Aye. Yeah. And all those in favor of raising tail and letting the juices fall where they may say nay. Aye. Uh, aye. Yeah. Nay. Nay. It's two against two. Uh, let's see. That's one aye, two nay. No, Bugle said aye. <laughs> Persuade you with a gift, a present, a peace offering, an appeasement? Exactly. Nope. No way. None. There's nothing you could offer that would make us move. Nothing, could huh? Could I persuade? No. Not this. Okay, so let's try. No way. I'll never get close enough. That smell is a killer. Okay. No way. I'll never Wait, what if I use this on myself? Ooh, I've got it. I'll just put this clothespin on my nose. Then I won't be able to smell the skunks. Did that work? I think that worked. Could I persuade you? Nope. No, not oh, wait, if you hear him talk. Could I persuade you with a gift? <laughs> a present? A peace offering? <laughs> An appeasement? Because he's got the thing oh, over his nose. Oh! Hey! Whoa! Okay, I don't think I can get past him, but I can get closer to him now. There's no way I could hide behind that without getting soaked. Getting soaked. There's no Hang on, Boogle. We're going in. We're going in. Olay. Yikes. <gasps> thing is melting. Oh. Ah, got rid of the skunks. No, don't put that back in your pocket. Get rid of that. Ew. Carpet one each stinky. Yeah. Ew. I know people in venture games like to hold everything, but come on, dude. Oh, we're going up here to talk to this guy now. So who or what is this thing? It's just hanging out meditating, apparently. I like the music. Greetings, sir. awake greetings sir I could have sworn he squirmed just a little then hmm greetings sir there we go what who are you and why are you here I'm Torin who are you that's what I'm trying to determine <laughs> I mean, how you doing what's your name name Vida, is this why you come here? To torment me with unimportant questions? Where are the real questions? The ones aching deep inside you? Who are you? What do you believe? What do you know? Actually, I haven't really gotten to those questions yet. My question is more simple. Simpler? Huh? Whatever. I'm trying to find a sorceress named Licentia. Could you help me? Forget her! I know the girl you should meet. Sweet girl, good to her parents, clever conversationalist. She has a nice personality. Why do people keep describing it like that? I think not. See, I'm only here for a short stay. I need to find Licentia. Remember her? I asked you about her a few seconds ago. Never heard of her. 
Do you know how to get to the lands below? Do you know how to help the area below? What? I don't understand. You'd understand if it was you sitting on this stone tile all day and all night. The parts below, the bottom line, the rear guard. Are you trying to say your seat is uncomfortable? Uncomfortable, don't cut it. My seat's boiling. My buns are burning. Oi, I need relief. I see. Hmm. No, you don't see, and you won't, because I'm not showing it to anyone. <laughs> now, just go away, and I'll continue to suffer in silence. Somehow, I wonder if that's, I I wonder if that's what I need the, uh, this for. Are you trying to say your seat is uncomfortable? Uncomfortable, don't cut it. My seat's boiling. My I see. No. Something. Yeah. Here's a thick, soft cushion I think you'll like. I mean, that makes logical sense. Oh, it's sitting on a tile. Oh, look at that. Let me feel. Ah, fine materials. Nice padding. Soft cover. Firm, yet breathable. I thank you very much, O tall, slender one. <laughs> and in return, why don't you take this instrument of my torture? Just drop it over a cliff someplace if you don't want it, okay? Oh, I would never do that. So he has six of these. And from the thing in um, the King's Palace, it looks like there were nine total with one already there. So I need, what, two more of these? Looks like the cushion is working. Yes, it is. Much better. Thank you again. Now get out of here. <laughs> looks like... Yeah. Okay. I think we've done everything here. We got this green person up here. We do have some items that could possibly, oh. Oh, it's cleaning. And we had this thing full of all this stink. So do we give that to her? And then I don't know how we're gonna defeat the ladder just yet. But I, I do think we have at least one solution ready to go. So let's go ahead and figure that out first. Head on up. Oh, I can see him over there with the blanket now. So, oh, that's not working. Hmm. I would've, that one works. What would that do? Tile formerly known as sign, that's a tile. So now we have two, four, six, seven. I still don't know how to defeat the ladder puzzle. Hmm. And I don't think I have anything new either, except for the stink area. I think that's the only thing that I have that's different from before. Well, we'll take a look at it. Come on up here. And then we go down this way. Sweet smelling. Can't do anything with this. I need that tile. Is what I need. But how do I get down here without dying? Such a dear. 
Hmm. Alright, well, this may be a good time to stop. Let me hit the thing here. Oh, I can't hit the thing here. But anyway, this is, yeah, it's a good time to stop. Uh, thank you for everything, my friends. I love you all so very much. Uh, this is our continue blind let's play, Torrent's Passage for the PC. Uh, I believe I know what I'm doing. We gotta get all the tiles. We gotta get, like, online tiles. And... And the question is... How do we get down here to get the last tile? Because I think the one in the middle is just default. And then I think what you do is you gotta do that puzzle game. We gotta slide the puzzles around and like make something out of it. But yeah, uh, I'll talk to you again very soon. Until next time, so long and take care. Thank you for watching this video. Feel free to comment on what you saw and what you'd like to see next. I always love to hear your thoughts. But before we go, please remember that you matter and you are brilliant and you are loved, and you should always be true to yourself. Never let the world tell you any different. Much love to you from your friendly, feathered, flightless bird.